First at 5.30, 12 News is your local election headquarters. The Associated Press has projected Attleboro Mayor Paul Haro as the winner of the Democratic primary in the race for Bristol County Sheriff. Haro won the three-way race and will now face incumbent Sheriff Thomas Hodgson in November. Thank you for joining us on this Wednesday. I'm Mike Montecalvo. And I'm Kim Kaluni. And 12 News reporter Anita Buffoni spoke to both Haro and Hodgson today. She joins us now live in studio with why they say Massachusetts residents should be voting for them. Anita? Well, Kim and Mike, Bristol Bristol County Sheriff Thomas Hodgson points to his track record in that office, which he's held since 1997, as a reason voters should support him. But Paul Haro, the mayor of Attleboro, says it's time for a change. Attleboro Mayor Paul Haro and Bristol County Sheriff Thomas Hodgson are set to face off in the November election for Hodgson's job. Haro won the Democratic nomination Tuesday, taking more than 41 percent of the vote, according to the AP. He defeated a Fall River attorney and a former Somerset police chief. I want to run a rehabilitative institution where we're really measuring what we're doing and make sure it works. That's something he's not doing. He's referring to Hodgson, who has been sheriff in Bristol County for 25 years. Haro believes if elected, he can tackle the recidivism rate and establish a more modern prison system. They're trying to narrow it into it's just corrections and rehabilitation is uh, is minimizing the potential for the taxpayer. Hodgson expresses pride in his community outreach and crime programs he hosts to prevent kids from going to jail, but Haro questions their effectiveness. The ideas I bring are, you know, ideas that are best practices from other places, whereas his are just sort of uh, like political positions. This is a law enforcement job and it requires um, an understanding of the full breadth of the office of sheriff, which includes the partnerships we have with law enforcement. But it's not clear at this moment if Haro will have united support from his own party. One of his Democratic rivals, Nicholas Bernier, said today he is not ready to endorse Haro, arguing the Attleboro mayor went too far left in his campaign. Anita Buffoni, 12 News.